In this video, I will show how to use piecewise linear input source for verification of circuits in Cadence Virtuoso. For this demo, I have considered a CMOS inverter circuit. There are three input sources right now V1, V2, and V3. First one is a pulse source. You can see the properties of that. It is a pulse. I have defined the pulse source with a period of 10 nanoseconds and 20. Let me disable this too by pressing shift delete and this one also. Now this is the only one enabled. You can go to the launch. Edit transient of 100 nanoseconds. I want to plot the input followed by the output. Click OK. Just run the transient analysis. This response is the pulse response for the CMOS inverter. This time, I will disable this first source. Press delete and enable the second source by pressing shift delete. Check and save the design. Observe that this is the piecewise linear source. Check the object properties. I have defined number of pairs of points to be 9. You can increase them. And gradually for time 1, voltage 1, 0 seconds, 0 voltage and 2 nanoseconds. 0 voltage at time 3 that means gradually I am increasing for different values I can specify this I can go on if I increase the number the time step is going to increase so I am providing this as the input this is called as the piecewise linear if you want to get this go to the instance go to the analog library and V P W L. So this is the source. Or if you want, you can go to the browse. There you can find V P W L. A pulse source. You can define all this. You can if you want. You can increase it to 20 points also. Check the properties. Now it will show you 20. 20 time steps. Check and save the design. Just click on netlist and run. This time we are plotting it for the input piecewise linear with 9 input voltage sources so this is the response for different values let me decrease this to simulation 2 20 nanoseconds Rerun the simulation. Observe the response of this. So gradually initially I was at 0, 0. Then the second point is at 0 volt 
that is 2 nanoseconds 0 volt then moved up to 0 0.5 volts at 2 nanosecond then so gradually you can create your own input by using the piecewise linear i'll show you one more this time disable this shift delete and enable the third source this is called v source v source that is you can go to this browse search for v source this is that v source symbol get into the design here you can provide different types if i select this pwl it asks me to provide the path of the file let me click this and show the object properties here i have provided the path of the file this is the path which i where i have placed the file let me show that file also pwl 33.txt let me minimize this this is the file for 0 0 that means initial coordinate 0 comma 0 then 2 nanosecond the voltage is 0 then 2 nano plus incremental of 0 0.01 pico the voltage is 0 0.1 so like that we have to write this text file that is called piecewise linear text file once this file is saved you need to provide this path as an input to perform the simulation of this source let me check and save the design rerun the simulation it shows only this or let me change the path I have another file which was created 22 check and save the design I want to simulate it for 50 nanoseconds or 50 nanoseconds click on this This is the response of the inverter. For piecewise linear, initially zero value, then two nanosecond, then incremented for half, then the input goes in this manner. If you want, I'll show the simulation of the NAND gate as well. Let me close this. Save the design. This is the NAND which we have created. These are the sources. Just edit them. The same path.
and this one also the same check and save the design go to the launch edl right click transient analysis of 50 nanoseconds i want to plot a b and output as v out click on netlist and run I have considered the similar input and output patterns. You, if you want, you can reverse them. You can verify the output results. So for 1, 1 it is 0. So this is the maximum value, this is the maximum value and this is 0 for a NAND gate and for other values it will be high.